bending the curve is healthcare economists' jargon for reducing costs. They're currently very excited. The last few years have seen spending growth come right back. And that's actually got huge implications for the budget. Because if you keep spending growing faster than GDP, healthcare becomes a bigger and bigger share of the economy. Eventually, we're all just doctors or nurses. So we're excited about the recent decline in healthcare spending growth, but should we? It turns out if you go back to the 90s, during the early 90s recession, we saw a similar decline. So one school of thought says, maybe this is just the recession. Perhaps, but the truth is, as the authors find, it's just plain hard to tell. Their story is that long-term healthcare growth is all about new innovations. Now, innovation's normally a good thing, but in healthcare, often we get high cost, pretty useless innovations. New technologies, new techniques, incredibly expensive, don't do a lot. And the more of these that come down the pike, the more that get funded, the more healthcare costs cost will uh, continue to expand. At the end of the day, they're mildly optimistic. Uh, over the long run, healthcare costs in the United States have run at about the rate of GDP growth, plus 2.5%. They suggest it'll be about GDP growth plus one to one and a half percent. So healthcare will still be a rising share of the economy, but a little slower than, than we may previously have thought.